the very first Nimbus plane was a hand launch which required badly landing, adding difficulties to mapping applications. At the end of 2017, Foxtech started working on Nimbus 180 Vito with the advanced tricopter tilting rotor system. After numerous flight tests and adjustment, Nimbus Vito version 1 was finally released in February 2018. Nimbus version 1 was able to carry a 6S 10,000 dipole battery and also a 300 gram payload. Its max flying speed was 33 meters per second and was able to take off and land in a wind speed no more than 8 meters per second. The combo included X9D radio, data link, power amplifier, range booster, which requires many power supplies, and a ground station, adding complexity to field work. In July 2018, Nimbus Vito experienced a major upgrade. The power and speed of the tilting servo were doubled, and the front motor's thrust was also increased. As a result, the max payload was then increased to 800 grams while using 10,600 lipo battery, and the max battery size the Vito can carry was also increased to 12,600 lipo. An anti-wind factor was also added to the firmware so the front motors can tilt to a certain degree to hold the plane in the wind. After the upgrade, the Nimbus Vito can take off and land in a wind speed up to 12 meters per second, while the max flying speed was increased to 35 meters per second. The max flying time using 12,600 dipole battery was also extended to 50 minutes. The wagging problem until in early versions was also totally solved. Foxtech did not stop its pace. As the Nimbus Vito went mature, MAP-02 and MAP-A7R mapping cameras with the hot shoe function were also developed. Both cameras are very light and powerful. In order to control the Nimbus Vito in a much easier way, we developed a new radio with the name as DA16, which integrates data link and the radio link up to 5 km range and many good functions. The mapping work can be done now with just a Nimbus Vito, a radio, and a laptop or tab. Other jobs could meet intense hot and cold weather. To ensure the pilot having a comfortable outdoor working condition, Foxtech developed a relay system called RB20, based on the DA16 radio link and a very powerful data link. RB20 increased the data transmission and the radio range to more than 30 kilometers. And it can be placed within 5 km range with the DA16 radio. That means it can be placed at a high building, increasing the range of data link and the radio link. Meanwhile, the drone operator can now operate a drone, which is miles away, in a comfortable room or van. Even so many upgrades were made, we still never give up innovation. In August 2018, the world's first seamless onboard battery swiping system, the PG-20, was invented. The PG-20 has two input and one output ports, supporting 3S to 6S LiPo or lithium-ion battery, and is able to swipe the two input batteries for the output. After all the upgrades and improvements, the current version of Nimbus Vito is able to fly 100 km range with a flight time up to 90 minutes. Up to 8 square kilometer area can be covered with a single takeoff by using 65 side overlap and a high grade A7R mapping camera with a resolution up to 5 cm. By using the RDK and the PPK system, the mapping precision of Nimbus Vito is reaching centimeter level and the elevation precision reaching 10 cm. Nimbus Vito version 2 is the most affordable Vito on the market with the biggest single flight coverage. 
it is just the spirit of pursuing the good quality and a great product give birth to the great mapping machine, the Nimbus Vito, and it could be the best one in the small scale mapping machine system. And uh, we will continue to offer you great solutions for the industrial use and also other systems like a mapping system and also the gimbal system in the future.